and that is the fact that in round six and seven of that fight, Ray Leonard seemed to have won by a wide margin, and yet they were only scout period. 30 seconds into round one, middleweight championship. Switch hands on you, too. He'll go southpaw, he'll go the other way, he'll go everywhere, just to confuse him a little bit. And that's the reason I want to give him an opportunity to make some money. Mark here, and Hagler draws a warning to keep his hands up. And a right hand stands him up again. Marvin Hagler looking extremely shocked first round. He can hit you in the body, in the back of the head. Um, I'd rather fight him on the outside. Combination of the early going here. Marvin Hagler looking extremely sharp. And Hampshire scores with a right hand. And a left hand. And a good left hand again. And the knees wobble for just a moment. Another right hand getting right in on the chin of Mustafa Hampshire. Hampshire fights back. Tries to swarm again. Takes two shots. Gives one. Hampshire the kind of guy off of Hampshire. Round three upcoming now, a little bit. I look at him as being a great champion. And Marvin continues to talk. Marvin is just fighting like a man possessed right now. Tired of butts. It happened in the first, at the Fermo fight, and it happens here in round three. And Hagler remains very sharp. Right hand now, but I do think he wants to get this over with. A couple of punches scoring there by Hampshire. I would hate to see the fight stop on cuts. Round no blood showing from Hagler right now. Hagler gets right back to work. Combination by Hamshos. Keeping his man off balance. And a right hand scores, but a counter punch by Hamshos scores on a Hagler. Again. Right hand scores by Hamshow to the side of the head of Hagler. Hamshow again swarming on his man. And I don't think, although a championship is great to have, at this point now it's not worth your help. A surgeon here, there's no question about it. Again, scores two more times. Got to be here. Hampshire comes back with a right hand and scores with another right hand. And Hagler just and Marvin Hagler, as is his job, continues to score almost at will on the face of Mustafa Hampshire. Hampshire dead game. And who normally is very excitable, picked that moment to be very calm because he knew he had to be. And he told Mustafa Hampshire, you just got to get out and do it right now, because if you don't, I'm pretty much a boxing best. You don't see Bob the Springs talent. He doesn't want to do anything to get in any more close in contact than he has to, but we're realizing he's in control, is back to being the taskmaster that he was early. I think it was obvious. Blood showing under the left eye of Hampshire now, as well as on top of the left eye. And there's a short right hand that I'm amazed Hampshire can stand up under. That was a heck of a punch. Short right hand scoring on Basilio. And Basilio's left eye was completely shut and bleeding. He looked like a cyclops, and he went 50. The bleeding seems to have stopped a little bit. And he just landed. Looping right hand by Hamcho. Trying to get off first, and that's what you heard Braverman telling him. You're letting him get off first. It opens the set up. He have a better chance of setting up. Hampshire uh, just trying to get on top of his man, get in close, and of course that doesn't help the cuts at all. So when Hampshire does get another right hand, you hear about Braverman. His fighter on talent, the way he utilized the ring, work his combination. Hagler just working his man, circling him to the left. Connor Putt showing on the side of the eye once more of Marvin Hagler. And there's the right hand that sends Hampshire wheeling. Hampshire, come on. Well, there is no questioning the fitness of these two fighters. There is no questioning the gamesmanship of these two fighters. Hagler comes right out with a right-hand lead. I think he got a pretty good indication. To determine whether or not Hampshire is really hurt because of his style. Downstairs and the right hand upstairs, and that wobbles the knees of Rightly should. I don't think you could script that any better. You know, whatever happens, Mustafa on his toes, he's fought flat-footed, he's changed styles, he's changed hands. He has a right hand by Hampshire. The great 
takes is the chin. And he Last draw does not really hurt Mustafa Hamsho, who has not but one time taken a backward step. To, to take advantage of it. Hagler beginning to score with the left hand a little bit now. And a combination once again by Marvin Hagler. And Hamsho's back in his own. And neither did Hagler. <laughs> and Hamsho opens. This is the last round he's given him. If he doesn't look any better here, the corner will stop the, the truth. Well, he did go over, did Al Braverman, and talk to Octavius. This is the last round of the fight. Let's see. Hagler continues to pound away to the body. Now they have with the right hand. Hampshire tries to... Uppercut scores by Marvin Hagler and another right hand to the face, and the eyes continue to bleed and will stop champion Marvin Hagler. Second fight in a row, of course, that he was butted. The winner by technical knockout is still the world's middleweight champion.